I would have to say my best moment was um, when we won gold and that last minute counting down, just listening to all the fans yell USA and pretty much just panning around the gym and just seeing everybody rooting for us was one of the, the best feelings and moments of my life. Um, my best memory from my first Olympics was um, Dawn Staley was a captain on our team and she got selected to be the flag bearer for our entire country. So by far my favorite memory was walking into opening ceremonies hearing them announce the U.S. and because Dawn was the flag bearer, we got to stand in the front of the line. Yeah. So we were one of the first people to enter and it was really cool. Just being a part of the team was uh, was something that was um, was just was awesome and obviously was uh, um, that year was um, was a lot of fun. We, we ended up you know being able to win but just the, the journey that the team took and the journey that we all had together was really um, really key and just really the whole the month was a lot of fun. My dad my dad cried my first Olympics it was like a big a big deal like he was so proud of uh, me making that team and winning the gold medal I gave him the gold medal and he just like broke down in tears so that was my my biggest memory. Uh, my best memories from watching the Olympics is, is obviously watching the men and women uh, compete for a gold medal. Well, I've had uh, so many great ones. Probably my first one in Athens has been uh, amazing. Um, you know, that first one really is alive, and now this last one hopefully is just a special. You know, when I think of the opening ceremony, I think of, you know, watching on TV when I was a kid and growing up watching the Olympics, and I'm not sure what to expect. I think that, you know, Brazil is going to do a great job hosting it and make sure it's, you know, one of the best ones we've seen. As far as like opening ceremonies and everything like that, uh, I don't know, I'm, I'm excited to just experience my first Olympics, so I'm kind of just wide-eyed and taking it all in. I don't think I have one person in particular. Um, I know there's a lot of people from track and field to volleyball to, uh, <laughs> to beach volleyball and stuff like that, so I got the chance to meet a lot of people that I'm grateful for. Oh, I mean Kobe, LeBron, uh, all those guys. Um, I got to meet them on, you know, at the last Olympics. Yeah, and um, and just kind of um, at the opening ceremonies, a lot of great athletes. That, um, Whew. Well, um, in the first Olympics, I met Manu Ginobili, who's my hero. So this is my last one. I hope I see Manu again. Yes. So Manu, for sure. You know, there's obviously some some Olympians that are, you know, American terms iconic and you know Michael Phelps um, if Dara Torres was still swimming it'd be her um, you know people like that. I went to the University of Minnesota so a bunch of uh, players that went to the University of Minnesota were on you know different teams volleyball and, and whatnot and it was really cool to uh, to meet and catch up with them again. I got to meet Bolt, kind of like walk into uh, the arena for the opening ceremony, so that was pretty cool. I mean, he was just like a, a, a regular guy, just kind of enjoying life, um, but when he steps on that track and field, like he's the biggest star of the Olympics as far as what he do and how he's able to, uh, you know, do what he do on the track and field. Um, that question again, I don't think I want to choose one person in particular, um, but if I have a chance, I would like to meet both at some point. You didn't meet him? No. Really? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, maybe someone, uh, someone I'd like to meet. Oh yeah, I want to meet Usain Bolt. If I can, it would be amazing if Mr. Bolt. You didn't meet him? I didn't, I didn't meet Usain Bolt, no. And, uh, the way he's dominated his sport, um, I just have so much respect for him. So if I could meet Usain, that'd be awesome. Oh, I don't know. I'm showing me somebody really cool that's on uh, that's on one of the teams that uh, that um, that you could say that you got to meet. So I'm not sure this time, but yeah, we'll see. I mean, whoever I run into, it's always an honor and a pleasure to see you know other Olympians at their best and, and you know doing what they do well. I wanted to go see swimming, try to get to gymnastics, uh, but I really want to go see a track and field event, but I know it's like jam-packed, everyone wants to see that, so hopefully I get a chance this year to go and, and witness a track and field event, the 100 yard dash or the 4 by one relay, one of them, it doesn't matter. Um, I think there's a few sports I want to watch, I want to watch uh, swimming, I don't know if we're going to be able to see soccer, but beach volleyball, I really want to go to gymnastics, I really want to... Uh, I really want to see uh, diving. Uh, I can't swim, so anything <laughs> dealing with a pool and swimming, uh, 
I think is amazing. So those are the two that I really, I really want to see. And of course, you know, going and supporting our men's basketball team as well. Yeah. Well, because this is my fourth Olympics, I've actually seen a lot of sports. So I've seen soccer, I've seen men's basketball, I've seen track, I've seen women's beach volleyball, I've seen um, water polo, a ton of stuff. But I've never seen swimming. So that would be one that I'd want to see. So my first Olympics, I get to the gym, and we're ready to get dressed to go on the court, and I put one shoe on, and then I put the other shoe on, and I brought two right feet. <laughs> so I had two of the same shoes on in the very first game in my Olympic experience. A funny story, hard to say. I think just uh, being there with my family was probably the best part. My family got to go, so. Is it just stress or? I don't know, I just packed two right feet, and then I had, you know, we had to go back to the hotel, get them, bring them, so that was my first game in the Olympics. Crazy moment? No, I'm too boring. I don't have any more. I don't have any moments. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>